Riku? Ah? Uh? Oh? No, never heard of him.
how to handle this!
Way to go! Once again, you have served China well. It would please me to reward you. What is it that you wish? Well... You say a guy in black came to see you. What did he say? That is all you request? Yes. Dragons have crossed our land and left a great web of paths. These dragons wield much power, and they are the source of many gifts to both man and nature. But it would seem someone of evil intent disturbed one of our dragons and transformed it into what you call a heartless. It is my belief that this young man came to warn me of that danger. Then I could alert and prepare my troops. Did you? <laughs> I was about to, but he told me the situation had changed. He said three wise guys had arrived, and they would take care of things. <laughs> That's gotta be Riku! But what's he doing hanging out with Organization 13? No idea, but at least I finally know he's okay. That's good enough. Yeah, that's good! Now then, Famula, do you have a request? I'd like Shang... Uh, I mean, well, the captain. Yes, yes, my dear, what is it? Could the captain have a vacation, please? <laughs> I hardly expected such humble requests. In this case, I'm afraid I must refuse. Captain Lee's responsibility is to protect the Emperor. And yet, Mulan... Yes. Would you like to serve alongside him and protect me? Huh? What? Two reeds together are stronger than one. But the choice is yours alone. Thank you, Your Excellency. And I goes well. So do I. But I wonder why he's so nervous. The master does have his shy side, you know.
tonight is very important. Oh, maybe we came at a bad time. Well, there's only one way to find out. Donald! Now then, Monsieur, Mademoiselle, please enjoy the evening. And of course, our honored guests are welcome too. A uh, welcome indeed. The organization! You don't know when to quit. Oh yeah, well, sure, yeah. Get out! Not tonight. I've come to take something you hold very dear. Yes, let your anger grow. Beast, we have to get rid of these guys first. Yes! Beast! Get out!
didn't you? Don't you see what's happened? Hey, what's with you? The rose. My rose. What? That? He took it? But surely you can find another rose. Silence! You don't know anything! That's not fair, Beast. Don't take it out on Belle. It's not like she stole it. <sighs> I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. But... Sora, I want you to leave the castle. Look at me. Look. This is what I am. When you first got here, I tried to change. But I was only fooling myself. I can't be any different. I'll always be a beast. So I should live like a beast, with no one alone. Goodbye, Belle. You can't mean that. Oh, I think his mind's all made up. Yeah. Look, Belle, leave this to us. If we can get the beast's rose back, he'll calm down.
Hey, beast! <sighs> Leave me alone. Come on, you need to hear this. You used to be fearless. You would have given your life to save Belle. Don't you know what that meant to us? You gave us all courage! Hmm. <laughs> Maybe you should have kept some for yourself. I mean, are you really gonna throw your happiness away? The Rose is your only hope, isn't it? Well, it's the only hope for Cogsworth and the others, too. So don't throw away your last chance. Remember what it was like before Belle lived here? See? You can't give up. Not now. I know one thing. What? This castle belongs to me. Zaldin will never be welcome here. After all, you had me worried. 
I was afraid you'd given up for good. What do you guys really want? Kingdom Hearts. When Kingdom Hearts is ours, we can exist fully and completely. So you see, Beast, that's why we need your Heartless and your Nobody. Is that? Look! It's the rose! Rather travel light. What shall I leave behind? Bell or the rose? Good one, Bell. Yeah! Ha! 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 Ha
Here, it's yours again. Belle? I know. You want me to leave the castle. <sighs> what matters is, you weren't hurt by Zaldin. You're safe. And, um, I'm very grateful to you for bringing the Rose back to me. Hmm. Thank you. It's the least I could do. You've been good to me, and you didn't have to be. Listen, Belle. Yes? <sighs> oh. Say it. Go on! Come on! You can do it. We have confidence. Don't be bashful, Mel. Well, I'd like you to stay with me, please. I will. My strong music. Hey, did you see the look on Belle's face when she grabbed that rose? Huh? Yup, she sure was having fun, all right. She is rather unique, isn't she? Always ready for a little adventure. The two of them do seem made for each other. Yeah, they sure do.
Hey. Herc, you feeling any better? Well, same routine. Wonder Boy here thinks his hero days are over. And Phil thinks it's all in his head. Gorsh, Herc, we know you're a hero. That's right. <laughs> Blunder Boy. How could you mope on a momentous day like today? The Underdrome's back, and you are gonna fill the stands. After all, your fans won't settle for anything less than a certified hero. I mean, if you're not up to it, you could always just, I don't know, lose. I bet you'd like that. Excuse me? Hey, I'm not a selfish guy. I'm not like those high and mighty snobs up on Olympus. I stand for the masses, and have I got a massive idea. The games, ladies and gentlemen, are back. Yours truly, Hades, the one and only Lord of the Dead, brings you the ultimate games to celebrate the reopening of the ultimate Colosseum. We'll finally answer the age-old question, who deserves the title Ultimate Hero? These games are gonna settle the debate once and for all. The winner reigns supreme. Of what? You guessed it! The Hades Cup! And I assure you that the great Hercules will be there, otherwise... You'll never see your girlfriend again. Low life! <laughs> You're too kind, kid. <laughs>